Of course, the matchup features two of the top four favorites to win the Heisman Trophy. JT Daniels started the final four games for Georgia in 2020. He went 4-0, while DJ Uyunglele started a pair of games filling in for Trevor Lawrence. For more on Clemson's new quarterback, let's check the tape with Michael Felder. Yeah, when it comes to DJ Uyunglele, look, we're going to do a little tape don't lie for him because it's his time to shine. And when he plays, look, we got a taste of it a year ago with Trevor Lawrence out, right? We got, him see, we got this chance to see him start two games, and he really delivered. Here's the thing. Kid from Cali coming to Clemson, and this is what you're going to get out of him. First, let's set this up. Look at this big package, right? It's fourth and one, short yardage. What can he do? Let's go make a play. And I love this out of him. You get a little bit of that run action that draws the linebackers up. Look at everybody bunched up right here because they're worried about that dive, that quick give but instead he sees it he reads it he recognizes that this guy cannot get him and let's go let's pull it and let's go out of the gate and look at the way I love this look at the way it looks like they've got an opportunity to tackle him but watch does it? It's effortless. Effortless athleticism is one of the things we know we're going to get with DJ Uyangalele. This guy has great speed in his game. The next thing though Calm under pressure, and I love this right here. So watch this. You're going to get a pressure right here, and I love how calm and composed he is. This is a freshman. Remember, this is a freshman showing that composure. Now watch this. Okay, we got pressure in my face. What do I do? I recognize that Travis Etienne trying to be covered by a linebacker who's inside the hash still. That's a mismatch. So what do I do? Make it an easy catch for my running back and get him out the gate. Let's go. Run, 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 run. Again, you get to see that athleticism out of Clemson. We'll see if Lynn Jake Dixon is the guy that's catching those passes as well because he's going to be the face at that running back spot for them. But look, pressure in his face, handles it, recognizes the mismatch. Let's go to the house. And last but not least, and I love this for him, it's his ability to throw the football. A lot of times people assume, oh, he's a running core. Quarterback. Oh, he's just athletic. He's not a true quarterback. But this play is on here for a reason. His ability to manipulate the football, to put it in spots where he wants it, is highly, highly skilled. And that's something that you've got to respect about his game. I love this throw. We're going we're to get the replay here, too, because it's really cool. This is an amazing throw. It looks easy. It looks simple. But this is an amazing throw. So what you've got here is Amari Rogers, right? Now, inside leverage. They're going to try to play to the inside to get to the outside. So what do you do when, when that guy's got inside leverage? Boom. Watch the way he turns his entire receiver's body around. This is on purpose. He's got him covered to the inside. If that ball's inside, that might be picked off. But I'm going to throw it to the outside. Turn my receiver all the way around. Turn him around, and we're still going to get that touchdown. I love that out of DJ Uyunglele. This guy's got skills. The ability to manipulate the football, to put it where he wants it. He's also got the ability to push the ball vertical. He's calm under pressure, as we saw, against the blitz. And obviously, he could be an outstanding runner as well.